Big Island police want to speak with anyone who saw the huge fire that damaged a portion of historic Pahoa Town. The fire began early yesterday morning and ripped through the Akebono Theater. It caused an estimated $1.8 million in damage. The cause is still under investigation, but police do not suspect foul play. Meanwhile, today, business owners went back to what's left to assess the damage and promise to be back. Marissa Yamane follows up. A day after the fire, and we get to see just how much damage and destruction it caused. Definitely emotional. A painful sight to see, considering this here was the heart of Pahoa, a small town nostalgic of the past, located about half an hour south of Hilo, a town where people often stopped as part of their trip to Kilauea Volcano. The raging fire broke out on Monday just after midnight and gutted the historic Akebono Theater and Luquin's Mexican restaurant. Fire officials say the fire started at a vacant business next to Luquin's. And just the age of the building and the age of the town, it's probably lucky we didn't lose more. She says about 60 people are out of work because of the fire. And to think, for months they worried about the lava consuming their businesses. And Madam Pele did not do any of the damage. Authorities haven't said yet what started the fire, and police are asking witnesses to come forward. And part of the next step is disposing all the fire debris. Well, one of the con uh, concerns of the county is about that uh, we may have asbestos and some hazardous material in this uh, facility. A town that has a lot of history is now looking to the future. Definitely, you know, not going to just leave it vacant. Something will happen, and, and somehow we'll get something going. Marissa Yamane, KHON2 News.